I do, Ski? It's your boy, Farewell34, and today, I'm here with my reaction video to Farscape. This one is Season 1, Episode 4. How's it going, fam? Pretty much last time on the show, we had the Peacekeeper sort of infiltrating as uh, these little bug creatures took over the ship, the Moya, and uh, Aaron was, was kind of uh, down that episode. She wasn't feeling all too well. Gotta learn a little bit more about her. I like some of the lower tone moments in that episode as well as the character dynamics that we're starting to obviously, still super early on, but we're starting to really get into it a little bit. So with that being said, guys, I am jazz and I am ready to go to see how far this scape will be. Smack that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. But uh, I think with that being said, let's get right into it. Um, I got a new table, as you guys can see, it's glass. I didn't know if I'd like it at first. I actually do really like it, and it's better than my old shitty desk right there. It's uh, supposed to be the globe. I've had that since I was like two years old, and I've been using it since, so uh, it's about time I finished the studio properly um and i like it so if i'm sort of like adjusting or if i'm off a little bit let me know and i can if i'm too close i can uh, i can fix her up but uh all right guys this is farscape season one episode four yeet the point is i'm not going to meet that shuttle unarmed simple as that she's not about it we rigel the 16th my boy rigel of over 600 dargo subjects Sam? Zanny. <laughs> well, if it wasn't for me, we'd starve. On poison too, All it was I. All was stale food cubes. Suggestion. Well, who are you to offer suggestions? Okay, okay. tense. Things are tense. Creation that does... Let's see how terribly this goes. Move and you die. Oh, shit. You, you've misunderstood. <laughs> it's like a comic book. And now you die. Yo, Buckus. <laughs> okay, John. Let's go. Maybe if you guys weren't busy having conflict, you would have been a little bit ready. John is so uh, amalgamated in the group already, and I, I like their chemistry, <clears throat> even in this fight sequence. For a second, I forgot he was for like a like he got into an accident and is here by like he wasn't supposed to be here. It seems like he's fits in pretty well. Four episodes in. Look, enough talk. We are leaving now. How did you do that? It just happened. A little too much testosterone, Wait. buddy. From now on, I am in charge. This guy said, I am captain now. You go after him, I'll revive the boy. Okay, we still do have chemistry, but <laughs> we have to we have to find out our dynamics with each other a little bit more. Huh. Buddy! You can be disarmed without having to be disarmed. Right. Ooh. So what do we got? got bars. Stun gun? And the design of this one's yes. pretty sick too. Oh, oh as I say, I'll rip off all your arms. Enough of this stupid voting. From now on, I'll make the decisions. Oh, he's that's what we're doing, okay. Don't even think about we want Corvidium, purity nine, enough to fill your transport hat. Okay, what is Corvidium? They have a Hulk and now they have people unwilling to negotiate. This is perfect. No. That boy sleep. And that's until the juice comes in. Come out from where you're hiding, you coward. Oh, that's what it looks like. I was thinking, like, what does this creature remind me of? And it kind of looks like the uh, the creatures from Gears of War. Not entirely, so a little bit, though. A little bit. Also sort of looks like uh, Crocodile Dude from Suicide Squad. Now, do it to my face so we'll see you standing. Hello? This one's gonna got like a like a kill zone bane vibe to it. Fam, you're getting disrespected every episode. Oh, he's actually in shit. Who are you? I have six hundred billion subjects. Six hundred billion. <laughs> I love how out there this show is. This malfunction. I can't wait for him. Pilot, prepare the prowler. Very well. If you really wanted to wake him up, all you gotta do. Vic's vapor up. If we don't go that crystal back, we're gonna crash into the planet. I've got a. We can try negotiating with the tabloids. We can. I was, I was literally about to say, I'm like, John, don't talk too much shit because Aaron is a peacekeeper. We've seen how they move, and I don't think she's having it. The fact that you're, she's even letting you talk up this much was surprising. You ever looked at a mail before, huh? huh? Oh, here you go. Bruh. Bruh. 
quite respectable for your age. His nudity is taboo in your culture. Are you ashamed of your bodies? Yeah, we would be if we looked like you. This man really just showed his peace? And then tried dissing her? Because she didn't fuck, fuck with how he showed her? What is going on? Wait, what is going on? What the fuck? I have time to let them lead us back to their camp. I'm gonna have to force them to tell me where Rigel is. This is a pretty sick thing. How are you gonna force them? So it won't take long. When I get back, you can put me under and remove the gauntlet. She essentially said, Pepsi bottle, Your pardon. Coca Cola glass. I'm on my way I don't to give a damn. They're getting up. You gotta do something soon, Aaron. Sean. You don't know how that works. No. What did you do? I feel bad for Rigel. Although he kind of like brings it upon himself by <laughs> talking so much shit. She said, boy. This should relieve the symptoms of withdrawal. In what way, friend Rigel? Oh my god, that's what this thing sounds like. It's like the robot from uh, the Jacked In episode of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Like the eyes, the tone, and just being this big sort of like the creature. Soil. This is, an, this right, is a weird episode. Camp, we just stop oh god, that's a concussion, dog. Look at that blanket out yes. there, Dargo. A lumpy blanket. Get her off. I got you, fam. Don't hurt yourself. No, 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 no. No. You're killing him. Whoa, relax, buddy. Wait, what? Wait, what? <coughs> the fame of Dominar Rigel has spread even to my worlds. <laughs> that was kind of fucked. I was like, damn, they're really just gonna body Rigel. I'm gonna go check things out, play nice while I'm gone. I'm disappointed in both of you. How's the pain? Think about what you did. Somewhere out there, there's a whole world full of Crichtons. How useless that must be. <laughs> Amazing, he could actually provide us. My traitorous bastard of a cousin stole my throne and imprisoned me. I escaped. Oh, it's a gun too? Oh, oh, P. That's pretty hype. Perhaps the real you is sick of hearing your plaque. That I know for sure. I think I'm like cutting through a forest and with a machete. I request. Let you bury me with it. Oh. oh Ooh. The wound isn't cleansed until the blood flows clear. Stort. That shit looked like it hurt it. Oh my god. I can feel pretty good. <laughs> it's working. I feel real good. You don't even have the guts to fight me! <laughs> Oh, you didn't want the smoke, buddy. Okay. Reversal. And to think, he was a pilot in Lhasa not only four episodes ago. If we can. I'll have it your way. He's so enjoying this. Him, no gold, no jewels, no munitions. You don't believe me? We barely got each other. <laughs> hey, yo, fam, they got me in the bin here, stole! Okay. You spent time with them. Have you seen any riches on board? They got no guap, bro. <laughs> I won't lie for you. No one's asked you to. For some reason, the voices, do, they don't. Perhaps not they don't the sync choices. up, but. 
they, it doesn't sound like it's uh they sound like out of character but this i don't know the character but i don't know maybe just so the design i thought it would sound a little different <laughs> secure the bag <laughs> And that was my reaction video to Farscape Season 1, Episode 4. That was my reaction video. You know what? I thought this was an alright episode. Um, it was nice to see. There's a couple of things that I liked. Um, I appreciated seeing, uh, you know, a smaller story here. Dealt with you know, Rigel being, you know, them being robbed to an extent. Uh, them being robbed and having to get their item back. But tying in with Rigel and, you know, him being boastful and being this, you know, this lit king, but he's always, you know, put down and not really, no one recognizes him. Uh, so I, I like what they did with his character here. And I thought his, his like, his uh, cellmate uh, made for some interesting back and forth with one another. I thought the idea of having this gauntlet, I liked the portions of the episode where Zan was trying to, um, you know, help one, 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 of the, one, of the, one of their enemies. That was an interesting insight into her character a little bit. You know, uh, she's not just, you know, level nine priest or whatever it is. Uh, she's also a badass and can, you know, she'll deal the smoke if she has to, but that's not what she wants to do, right? So it was interesting to see how they decided to flesh out that storyline and see his line, the, that character's line of thought, like this is all I've ever known, having this, you know, gauntlet. And now it's my choice and I still decided to do it. So I thought that was an interesting, I guess, topic, substance abuse. And then the whole idea of them, like the, of them chasing out, chasing to get Rigel and then having the gauntlet on like each of the members. I thought that was whatever. I think that was sort of like the probably my least favorite elements to this episode. Though I did again, what I'm really enjoying is sort of the subtle lower tone moments, even if they're just little quips or, or you know, some, some banter back and forth between each of the members. Like I love the one with Dargo and Aaron, uh, where they're sort of both just talking shit about John. <laughs> Anyway, y'all, that was Farscape Season 1, Episode 4. I thought this was an alright episode with some pretty nifty ideas here. Cool to see some more aliens, although I didn't love their voices. I like the designs of them. I didn't like their voices. It didn't work for me. Also, if I was, like, looking around a lot or I wasn't sort of in the zone or I wasn't in frame, my apologies. I need to, like, figure it out. So this was the first video with this table, so maybe I might have not been adjusted properly. But, hey, guys, with that being said, that was this episode of Farscape. What do you think about this one? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comment section down below. And if there's anything of importance to this episode that I was supposed to take note of that I didn't, let me know in the comment section down below. With that being said, guys, that was it for this one, and I'll see you in the next one.